What's up coaches? Today we have a play diagram from Notre Dame's offense. The ball is near the left hash and Notre Dame is in a two receiver, two tight end, one running back personnel set. This is known as Tiger in the West Coast offense. The formation is solo left slot. Solo is a double tight end formation and slot tells a Z receiver to line inside of the X receiver. Due to the slot formation adjustment, the formation is now a three by one set. The play is called smash. Smash is a vertical high-low concept that usually isolates the cornerback. The outside receiver runs a hitch and the inside receiver runs a corner route. Notre Dame is running a variation of this play since they have three receivers into the field. Seeing that the offense is in the red zone, the progression becomes a two vertical read for the quarterback. With the defense aligned with two high safeties, the field tight end is stretching stretching up the seam to beat the middle zone defender. Think old, old style Tampa 2 coverage. The progression is now seam to the corner route. The outlet could be the hitch route. However, without much field, the quarterback can't hold the throw. He's taking three quick steps on his drop and throwing the ball towards the back of the end zone. If the tight end is covered, the quarterback is resetting his feet and looking for the Z receiver running towards the back right pylon. Notice that the quarterback doesn't even look into the boundary progression. Maybe against man coverage, the quarterback can work towards the running back's flat route to the corner route. With the running back aligned offset to the left of the quarterback, his release could create a natural rub seeing that the boundary cornerback is rolled up. For any questions, please leave a comment below.